What's up, y'all? Got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea, girl. Yesterday, my Wi-Fi was out the whole day. Crazy. So I couldn't get into these videos, but we're going to get into them now. We back at it. Let's get into it. In on Aaliyah J after Justin threw a little shade at Ramonte's content and then Aaliyah J laughed. As far as YouTube mm -hmm. or content creation, where are you at with that? Like, I don't know, because I feel like the market is so like different now. Like, I feel like now you could go viral if you woke up to somebody in a, a Walmart and be like, ma'am, like, your outfit is beautiful and now you get to go viral over that. It's like, I don't understand, like, I I don't know. I feel like my content has a little more substance than Okay, so she peeped the shade. That, but I have to understand that that's the market now. That's what gets popping now. Like, that's a lot of shit they putting on their face right there. Like, those little um, videos. And I just, I guess I just haven't... What I want to say, I don't know what I want to say, to be honest. Um, I'm fine. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's just a different social media time. Excuse me, ma'am. You look gorgeous. You are taking it with this simple fly fit. I love the pants. I love the glasses. And I love the slick knot bun. Could we get a little bun side profile? Ramonte responded. <laughs> Let's make it clear. I have hit viral videos you ain't wrong queen your bob is fat uh get off the phone and get in the field you almost knocked me over bookie is a fruit roll up sticky multiple 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 one i don't give a f don't try to make a steam like bitch. um this is what irritates me you know what irritates me y'all cussing the way they curse and i'm i can only tell y'all that because i have to edit curse words out from time to time it's just like why all of that in one little second y'all will never understand if you ain't editing out these curse words <laughs> always do like little underlying shit towards me or say something like underlying petty like catty so i could like respond and if i respond like how i want to respond i'm always like aggressive or i'm overdoing it and then Aaliyah, you sitting over there laughing when it's shading me what the fuck they was calling your ass big it wasn't funny when everybody was calling your ass big and making jokes about that you want to you make that face and it's called your ass huge so don't speak on me on the youtube <laughs> they called your Huge. Grow up and do something else. It's not 2016. It's not 2017. Stop talking about me. I don't go into Walmart. I go into Target. Don't use me as the comparison. Do something else because y'all knew talking about me was going to end up somewhere. If you want to tag me, and they did. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Y'all always f with me. Y'all always questioning what God gives me and why I'm in the position that I am and why I'm winning. I'm winning. I'm going to keep Period. winning. And I win fights too. Oh, but period. you know, we off that. Stop talking about me. Stop. Just please stop. How is? I don't understand how you mad. I don't. This is the thing that irritates me too. Why do people get so upset? As far as that, I'm concerned, hold on, Ramonte. Give me a second. As far as I'm concerned, he just read them. He just read them. Hmm? Ain't that what they call it? He read them. <laughs> nah, for real. Like that was a good read. Like. <laughs> people was mad at Clarence for so long like you don't do nothing you don't do nothing he rich and he don't do nothing and <laughs> that's not y'all's story I may have to work harder that's okay I know how to put in work but once again you don't know what that man went through growing up yeah never know or the work he put in in general behind the scenes that like I compliment people or like people like that. I compliment. I use him as an example because that's the only one I know as far as YouTube. And like, I didn't know about Ray Monte doing those types of videos and going viral. You know what I'm saying? I didn't know. Why are you mad that I'm spending positivity? But I talk about, I talk about police. I talk about the, I talk about a lot of things. I was going viral before I walked into Target, baby. Let's talk about it. Don't forget that daddy. Don't forget that daddy. I've been trending. I'm gonna keep trending. My content is amazing. My content is beautiful. My content is so much I fasted it. It's so much I fasted it. Step so your cookies mine. up. Make better content. Put some effort into the YouTube video, sir. They ain't paying attention. They ain't paying attention to me. Yeah, yeah. So stop questioning and focus on you. Okay? That's the type Your of stuff. Your friends say focus? I focus on me and my life. Okay? Ugly. And I'm. Said it. 
What Justin said wasn't big, but it was direct. And it was giving very much jealousy because Justin is trying to figure out how he's been next to Aaliyah J all these years and he's not as big or bigger than Ramate. But that has nothing to do with Ramate because he hasn't had no it girl and he has put in the work. Whether it's big or little content, he's still posting every day consistently and doing his thing. And sometimes it's not even about the person's content. It might be just the person's energy and who they are as a person to attract other people to them. Instead of Justin looking at Ramate as a threat, maybe use some of his formula, put a little spin on it, and maybe that will help your content out. But anyway, let's talk about this Maddie and Diddy situation because they ended up going off on each other on live. <laughs> y'all wanted me to talk about this. Let me give y'all the backstory before I show y'all the live. So after Corey got put out of Danny's house and they broke up, Maddie reached out to Corey via DMs and they were talking back and forth. Now, I don't know if Danny has Corey's passwords to his IG and she was the one that leaked it, probably so allegedly, but they were all in Corey's DMs and Maddie reached out to Corey first. She said, I'm gonna say this and then get the F on because it's in my heart to do so. You should have listened. I told you, go back home and get your D life together go to actual church seek help in jesus and stay out of relationships bye you okay uh girl why are you dming this man the last person on earth i would have dm was corey please Hey, Corey responded, I'm amazing. Maddie responded, you sure want to talk or you good? Corey responded, what the why hell would I want to talk to you? talk to you about Hello. I ask myself the same question I don't know why I care about your well-being but I do Corey said because you know I'm pure Maddie responded and you know I'm not evil all I ever wanted was for you to be a better man we don't even got to talk about ish I just know you're under some scary ish so although you f me over my love overpowers that and I'm always gonna make sure you're good Corey said how I f you over <laughs> Corey Maddie said let's not and then she goes into it like sis just get back with Corey you got up and left my because you believe the witch and her demonic people, LMAO, -O -O, literally. And now you see what I was trying to save you from. You got up and left, my dude. I wouldn't be surprised if Corey over there with Maddie right now. But anyway, you believe the witch and her demonic people, literally. And now you see what I was trying to save you from. You so caught up in yourself. Child, he is grown. You ain't got to save okay. him. Okay. Y'all stop. Pause and read over the here rest. talking like this, her son. All right, well, apologize to you then, genuine. Yeah, and I was actually pregnant for FYI, but okay, please don't void, Phil, please. I don't know. He did that face. She said, go home. He said, I have a house here in Houston. Bro, go to Alabama. Go home to Alabama. LOL, I'm in Houston. Don't believe everything you hear on this net. I'm gonna definitely put it in there. So basically delusional Danny was upset with Maddie for reaching out to Corey after the breakup. And during the argument, Danny kept calling Corey her man. And that's not her man. Yeah, but you was exactly. in Corey involved. I did do Okay, well, I don't know when was I in his DM saying that. When I heard that there was whatever, whatever going on, that's gonna turn anybody whatever, up. Whatever, whatever going and I, on. I ain't even mean for it to happen. Oh, so you, you really supposed I, to be turned up on him. Like, I if was turned up on that, him. That's what you don't get. I should be... Like, okay, thank you for letting me know. But I'm, I'm not thinking for sure. I'm trying I not to talk and I'm trying to get my hands on the I don't bitch. I don't want to Because she wanted to see you argue all day long. Money. You in Atlanta? You think somebody is going to figure out a view in Atlanta and I bet you are not going to be able to argue with you. Maybe they can see you in Atlanta already. Wait a minute. Hold on. Pause on the play. Stop the press. What are y'all saying? I'm so glad I'm over arguing in my life for the most part because don't play with me. But <clears throat> we can't even, we can't, we don't even know what y'all saying. Anyway, I don't fuck with Danny. Okay, I never be trying have, to say, and but, I never uh, will. Uh, I, you could say that you owe. I don't. I really don't give a fuck about you trying to look. Y'all, she can go on about her life. Everybody can go on about their life. But if I, if she thought I was gonna sit here and give her credit and twiddle my fingers with hers because she decided twiddle my fingers is crazy. That's some country. Was, Mandy, are you mad about Corey or Chaotic? Which one? Oh, child, what are you talking about? <laughs> Why are you supposed to tell you? You ain't I never said nothing bad about you or anything. You crying for me. Then you gonna jump in the DM trying to get back anyway. with the nigga after crying online with some flat ass. Like, anyway. make up your mind. Do you anyway. want the or do you want chaotic? What, anyway. Or the other nigga? Anyway. Who do you want? Anyway. So Which maybe one? that's all you got to, you got up here to say. Yeah, or you want the cap friend. Anyway, yeah, that's, that's all she got to say. Yep, yeah, that's okay, exactly cool. all I gotta say. But she knew when she did when two months ago. 
when he was in my house, when she was on the phone with him while he was at the gym, and she had her little fake prophet, her little whatever, get on the phone with him and tell him to leave me and all this. Shit. She knew what the f she was doing. She knew you wanted him, you got him. So now why the f is you sitting here and exposing him and doing all this extra? Shit? I told you what it was, woman to woman, before I knew anything about you. But the way that you responded to me as a grown ass woman, like you're five, six, seven, probably eight years older than me. The way that you responded, I could never fuck with you. I could never respect you. And I could never sit here and say, oh, thank you for what? I knew my situation. I came to you I as a young, I can't take Maddie serious. <laughs> younger woman telling you that I was hurting. I will never come on the internet and act like, <laughs> oh, this wasn't what it was. I was hurt. It, it, it was a heartbreak. This team, whatever her name is. I didn't go on, on my story and add her name and start popping shit. I texted her a long ass paragraph sharing my heart on the situation. It was funny to her. It was it was it was cackles telling her what's going on. I'm telling her this is what he's saying. I'm telling her how I feel about him, and it's it's funny to her. It's it's oh oh really? That's what he's saying. Okay, cool. You wanted him. You have his broke ass. <laughs> like now what? Oh, you mad because he left you too? Oh, mama, that's what he do. He's a narcissist. He gets up. He runs you dry. He get we need to get out of you, and he leave on to the next. At least he ain't cheat on me. I don't know why you sitting up here doing all this whoop de whoop about the nigga trying to expose him. Do all this extra. You wanted him, you got him, so now deal with it. Now pull your mother tracks out your mother head and do whatever it is that you got to do. But yeah, I'm not finna keep doing this. That's just, that's that. <laughs> I probably never take Maddie serious. Um, simply because, like, sometimes she she be ready and sometimes she just be sounding kind of crazy. And also, why would you reach back out to this fool after he thugged you like that on this hit internet? Girl, I just want you to get your shit together. Him. And I, you want control and it's not going to happen. Y'all can't tame a gorilla. He don't look like one, but he act like it. <laughs> but anyway, let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hey, yeah.